Hello viewers, thanks for watching our videos. If you not yet subscribe, please subscribe and hit the bell icon. So in this module, we are going to discuss simplify the following. That is x minus 2y into y minus 3x plus x plus y. So we are going to write this one. x minus 2y into y minus 3x plus x plus y into x minus 3y minus of y minus 3x into 4x minus 5 so let's take what is this is first multiply with the different different pictures that is big different different expressions so x into y x into y minus 3x into x minus into plus will become minus 2y into y minus into minus will become plus 2y into 3x next one plus x into x x into x minus 3y into x plus x into y minus 3y into y then minus of what you can do here is minus of let's multiply y into 4x y into 4x then minus 5y into y then we become minus 3x into 4x plus 3x into 5y why because your minus into minus will become plus so just take this all the expressions xy minus 3x square minus 2y square plus 2 3 is a 6 xy then plus x square minus 3xy plus xy minus 3y square so minus of let's take 4xy minus 5y square minus 4 3 is a 12 x x square plus 5 3 is a 15 xy so our next one is what you can do here is let's take all the things at a time so xy so here xy is there here minus 3xy is there then so xy plus 6xy minus 3xy then xy so let's take common of xy here 1 will come here 6 will come then here minus 3 then plus 1 plus 1 so here here actually let's take here minus of 4xy here also x is there we have to multiply minus of 4xy it will become minus so if you take this are all minus 4 that is minus 4 then let's go with x square terms plus let's go with here also 4xy that's 15 plus 15 but if you multiply with the minus then minus 15 will come minus 15 then here minus 50 then x square terms we are moving on x square terms let's take common of x square here minus 3 then here plus 1 then here minus into minus will become plus 12 x square then move on to the y square terms plus y square into so here minus 2 is there minus 2 then where x y square terms minus 3 so here if you multiply minus with the minus it will become plus plus 5 y square term so all the terms we are covered x square terms y square terms and x y terms so as usual if you do with this so x y terms all of them very fine so let's go with so 1 plus 6 7 1 plus 6 7 7 minus 3 plus 4 plus 1 will be plus 5 then minus 4 will be 1 1 minus 15 will be minus 14 minus 14 xy plus x square into what you can take here so actually 12 plus 1 13 13 minus 3 will become 10 plus y square into here minus 2 
minus 3 will become minus 5 minus 5 plus 5 will become 0 then what you will get 10x square minus 14xy so 10x square minus 14xy is the solution thanks for watching please subscribe yes, in this module we are going to discuss and we are going to continue this module second one so what is that is so our second one is m plus n into m square minus m n plus n square that will be equal to first multiply with the first term with the first term and first term with the second term and first term with the third term and second term with the first second term with the second second term with the third term so multiplying m into m square minus m into m n then plus m into n square that is plus n into m square minus n into m n plus n into n square then continue this one with m into m square that is m cube minus m square n plus n square m plus n m square n m square minus n square m plus n cube so we will take m cube m square n and m square n these two are will going to cancel why because opposite symbols are there n square minus m n square minus m these two are also cancelled m cube n cube that is the answer our next one is third one a minus 2b plus 5c into a minus b then minus of a minus b minus c into 2a plus 3c that will be plus 6a plus b into 2c minus 3a minus 5b then first multiply with this one so first we are going to multiply all these things a into a that is a square then minus a b minus 2b into a minus 2ab then minus into minus will become plus 2b square plus 5ac plus into minus minus 5bc then minus of a with 2a that is 2a square a into 3c that is plus 3ca minus 2ab then minus 3bc then it will be multiplied with c so minus 3a 2ac 2ac minus 3c square so plus into minus that one then plus still it is there plus 6a plus b what is that so you can take like 6a into 2c 6 2 is a 12 so 12ac minus 6 3 is a 18 18 a square minus 6 5 is a 30 a b then plus 2 b c minus 3 b a minus 5 b square that is the value so let's continue all a square terms and all b square terms like a square minus a b minus 2 a b so a b and 2 a b so minus a b minus 2 a b it will be minus 3 a b 3 a b these two are over plus 2 b square plus 5 a c minus 5 b c then minus into 2 a square minus 2 a square minus into plus will become minus 3 a c minus into minus plus 2 a b then minus into minus plus 3bc then minus into minus plus 2ac minus into minus plus 3c square plus 12ac minus 18a square minus 30ab plus 2bc minus 3ab minus 5b square so let's take our next one as so a square all a square terms let's take common here so a square let's take common 
So here a square means here 1 will be take common. Then here a square minus 2. Then is there any a square terms? Go there. So here minus 18. A squares all are over. That is a common. Next one. B square. Let's take plus B square common. Then here 2. Then B square where it will be? Minus 5. Minus 5 B square. So let's take plus A B outside. If you take A B outside here minus 3. Then A B over. So A C is there A C A B 2 plus 2. Then again A B where it will get? Minus 30. Here also A B over. Then minus 3. Then again go with here B square over. Then here A B over. Then all A B is over. Then let's take common of A C outside. So here plus 5. So plus. So A C will be plus 5 here. Then is there any A C? Minus 3. This is also over. Then A C plus 2. This is also over. Then plus 12. This is also over. A C. This are all over. Next one still it is there. Plus B C. Let's take common of B C. Here minus 5. B C will be over. Then plus 3. B C. Then B C where it will be? Plus 2. That's all. Then let's take common of here B square, A square, B C. Then finally C square plus 3 C square. So only one term plus 3 C square. That is the value. So let's take A square means. So minus. <coughs> so here minus 18 minus 2 will become minus 20. So minus 20 plus 1. That is minus 19 a square minus 19 a square plus so here minus 5 plus 2 minus 3 b square so why because subtraction so here 30 30 33 36 minus 36 plus 2 minus 34 so minus 34 a b then here also what you will get here minus 3 5 2 7 7 plus 12 that is 19 19 minus 3 will be plus 16 a c then here also what you are getting minus 5 plus 5 will be going to cancel everything so b c plus 0 that is b c into 0 plus 3 c square so what you can write finally here answer is so write all the positives first. So minus 19a square minus 3b square plus 3c square minus 34ab plus 16ac. So that is the answer. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Hello viewers. In this module we are going to discuss that is fourth one. We are continuing last video. So that is what they are given here is pq minus q or plus p r into p q plus q r minus of p r plus p q into p plus q minus r that will be equal to so what you can take so here first multiply with p q with p q that is p q whole square or p square q square you can take like that first with the second one plus p q square or y because q into q will get q square then minus p q square or p q into q r p q square r then minus q square r square q r like that next one plus p square q r plus p q r square minus of minus of p square r plus p 
PQR, we are multiplying PR with the remaining all the terms here, minus P R square plus P Q into P will be P square Q, then P Q into Q will be plus P Q square, then P Q into R will be minus P Q R. So let's write the same step as above one. So here P square Q square. Is there any P square Q square like that? Then write P square Q square plus P Q square R minus p q square so plus p q square minus p q square or so we're going to cancel later then q square r square q square r square it's not there minus q square r square plus p square q r so p square q r plus p q r square minus p square r minus p q r minus into minus plus p r square then minus into plus will be minus p square q then minus into plus will be minus p q square then minus into minus will be plus p q r so let's take cancellation of all these values p q square r plus p q square r minus p q square r then q square p square q square term anywhere there is no p square q square minus q square r square no then p square q r p square q r it's not there p square q r is also not that then p q r square p q r square is also not there then minus p square r plus p p r square p square r is not there p q r minus p q r plus p q r is there P R square, so P R square is also not there. Then, what you can write expression is like uh, P square Q square minus Q square R square plus P square Q R plus P Q R square minus P square minus P square R plus p r square minus p square q minus p q square so that is the value thanks for watching please subscribe